I always tried to be really careful about what creatives I actually chose to go to because I would yeah. take so much time off school to do these shoots right. and sometimes like you look at the photographer's book and you love all their work and then you get there and the concept of the shoot is just so out there and you know it won't fit your book and it won't fit your look and you're going to be there for 13 hours and not be paid and ultimately you're getting paid in photos and when you know that those photos aren't Are going to be productive for you yeah. that's really hard it's really hard to stay professional and it's really hard to like do your best um, and stay like upbeat and lively when you really don't want to be there. A lot of people think that, like, oh, it's a photo shoot, it's so much fun, but like when you've been there for 13 hours and you haven't had anything to eat and people are touching you all day long, it gets really, like, really strenuous. <laughs> I felt uncomfortable. Um, but I've never felt like someone has pushed my boundaries to a point where, like, I couldn't, um, you know, like, stand my ground. It's really different when you're in a foreign country, though, because you don't always know what job you're signing yourself up for. Um, I got to, like, on set once, and the wardrobe was, like, Playboy bunny, like, bustier bunny ears, like, curled hair, smoking a cigarette, and I, like... <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm literally okay with this being on a billboard, you know what I mean? Um, and like I spoke to the client, like it wasn't really a big deal. Um, we found kind of like a midpoint. Um, I wish my agency maybe had of expressed to me that that was going to be the nature of the job before yeah. I got it because the casting did not hint at all towards that. Obviously, you know, on shoots, like you're going to be asked sometimes if you're comfortable taking your top off or like if you're okay with like a see-through shirt or you're going to be put like there's been a couple situations where I've been doing a runway show and in the fitting you're wearing one outfit but then when you get to the show you're wearing something different and um, I've walked down the runway with my nipples hanging out so <laughs> that's really like difficult 16. I would say yeah. that's a negative like that was one of the more negative experiences because no one clears it with you and it is completely illegal you know what I mean mm -hmm. but no one even thinks of it because it's fashion and like yeah. everyone's so young and no yeah. one cares and like it's all about beauty but I mean there are people who you know I don't really want looking at my breasts I mean there's times where like there's going to be boundaries crossed and you have to find a way to you know speak up for yourself but you can't sacrifice your morals to be in an ad campaign or to have a great job because you'll lose yourself in it 